Hanging over the center of the field of the Dallas Cowboys $1.15 billion stadium are a pair of 70-foot-tall high-definition video screens that stretch from one 20-yard line to the other. For fans, they're hard to miss. And that was true for punters as well a few times in the stadium's first NFL game Friday night. Titans punter A.J. Trapasso booted the ball off the screen in the third quarter of the preseason opener in Dallas. The Tennessee rookie and veteran punter Craig Hentrick both punted several balls into the video boards during pregame warm-ups. The 60-yard long high-definition screens, one facing each sideline, are only 90 feet above the field. That's five feet higher than the NFL minimum. Cowboys punter Matt McBriar said the video screens are not an issue for him since he plans to kick to the sidelines. You really don't kick it down the field, down the middle. You kick it to the side. Nobody with any sense kicks it down the middle. After Friday's game, Jones said he's comfortable with the height of the video screens. McBriar said he could kick a ball up into the video boards 50% of the time if that's what he was trying to do. Tennessee coach Jeff Fisher, the co-chair of the NFL's competition committee, said the height of the boards is an issue. The NFL has said it will monitor the situation. Steve Carmison, The Associated Press.